What is going on guys? Welcome to this installment of Catch with Cletus. This is just gonna be a little introductory video for you guys to the newest addition to the Cleat fleet. This beautiful center console, 18 foot. It's a um, power schooner. And uh, this is gonna be a salmon trolling boat. Came with downriggers, some rods, Garmin. And I got a killer freaking deal on this thing. And uh, she needs some work, might have to repower her. But uh, I definitely wanna take you guys along for the adventure on this one. Um, she's gonna be a freaking beast. I mean, big, beautiful boat, solid, uh, hand built wood fiberglass. And uh, yeah, I mean, obviously she needs some TLC, but uh, yeah, we're gonna get her back. We're picking her up here right now in Houghton, Michigan. Got a beautiful background behind us. And uh, yeah, just uh, really excited to be maybe fishing out of this thing here this year, um, if I get it repowered, but uh, one step at a time. Um, but yeah, excited uh, to maybe do some sand fishing. All right, guys, we made it back to home base. Much well-deserved cold beer for this drive. Had to take a nap. Uh, I left at one o'clock in the morning to pick this up. I got there at 10, I got back to base at uh, about uh, one in the afternoon. So uh, made some uh, salmon for lunch and uh, got, uh, got a little sleep, but uh, up trying to make the most of the rest of this day kind of cleaning stuff out obviously there's leaves but uh you know um i was kind of brief in the parking lot i was a little bit tired um not really thinking great like on my feet so um you know <laughs> it was really struggling with the banter um because i was like basically brain dead um and still had like two hours over two hours to haul a boat um that i'd never hauled before um so um but as you can see made it one piece and uh, i've just kind of been going through some of the compartments in the boat and um, i just kind of wanted to briefly go over what uh what all the boat came with because you know price point i mean i'm almost embarrassed to talk about what i got this thing for not embarrassed but i like um you know you're trying to be humble but Guys, out the door, everything that I'm about to show you, 2,500 bucks. This is one of those Facebook marketplace deals that all you rednecks are looking for. And when you see it, you got till right now to make the decision on whether you're gonna go do it. And this was one of those sends. So uh, I called it like a power schooner or something in the last video. Uh, the make, the style of this haul is actually a power dory um this is kind of like uh you know an atlantic uh ocean style boat um owner was giving me a little bit of a history on it um and uh you know this is like lobster fisherman uh type rig but um he's got it set up for trolling for salmon and like again this all came with the rig and um you know i have actually I haven't even gone through all the apartments but the compartments but this is the sweet stuff that i think that we have with it um you know first and foremost obviously you got some extra trash some cruddy towels uh, a throwable i'm glad that that made made it on the drive i have no idea how um <laughs> the fuel tank is actually down in here i'll give you give you guys a little bit of a little bit of a tour um but i just want to do an introduction so i mean you know fuel tanks down in there probably needs a little bit of cleaning up um you know this kind of front this kind of just goes down into the, the into the hull um someplace i could throw uh an anchor um that's probably what that's gonna be for i have just enough room up here right, to put like an altera or something up here on the front of the rig um maybe a tarova don't want to get ahead of myself um you know i guess I'm, you see that my own two beers but um 
anyways so that's kind of what was in the front of the boat so but let's let's see what we got here so we got a cabela's depth master trolling series um and it looks like a you know cabela's brand depth master line counter reel this is this is actually pretty cool look at the look at the engraving on that reel it's actually really sweet looks like a striped bass or something on there right there and really cool reel i mean that looks rock solid daiwa you know big long trolling rod got to put some wings out on this thing um you know coming over here i mean look at this we got yellow you know some different boards we got yellow birds we got dodgers i mean i got this thing came with four boards you know we got a we got a, a dipsy here dodgers you know the fact that we got a got a freaking dipsy out of here i mean old beer cans i mean this was obviously fished pretty recently and what's great and what really blows me away is that this is rainier i, I found a boat i got a boat filled with rainier cans which is if you've never been to washington state that's like that's like uh you know the milwaukee's best of the west coast and uh you know local light beer you know this stuff needs to be cleaned out but some storage right here it looks like there's some water sitting in there i need to get that dried out um clean that out um cooler over there you know this is you know ice box kill box um you know a couple more counters got dialas lead core i mean really good stuff really good stuff and again all for the in all-inclusive price of 2500 bucks folks you know they say that uh, boats are money pits but um I might be actually be able to recover some money from this money pit. Um, but uh, anyways, um, the only thing why this thing is not ready to fish is because this motor is a little bit sketchy. Um, I have, you know, everything's still hooked up. I'm gonna just move some of the crap into the garage. Obviously this is, you know, boats covered in crap. Uh, ice fishing gear is still everywhere. Obviously we have a lot of uh, things to do, or I have a lot of things to do, I should say, before ice out. Anyways, gonna get this cleaned up, gonna hook the muffs up to this bad girl, and just, you know, check plugs, and, um, you know, see if I can figure out if, what, you know, if there's a seal or anything that's bad on it, but <laughs> all I know, folks, is that I got a super, badass boat with some serious mojo obviously got to clean up the uh the uh trailer a lot of rust and stuff on this but you know i got uh got the stuff to clean it up just gonna kind of seal it up for right now not gonna worry about painting it i got a little bit of light work to do on it but other than that uh this is one of those uh one of those deals where you feel like you got your money's worth but um, obviously you got to do some focusing and getting that done. We'll probably bring you guys along for some of that and tiny boat, probably going to start fishing out of this one this year. It's going to be the first one. Got to start tiny and we're going to work our way. And maybe in the fall, if you know, depending upon how soon I get that up and running, we take this bad girl out for her maiden voyage. So that's kind of setting up, uh, setting up the season i was just kind of doing this video to uh you know introduce you to this and what we got but i think this is kind of going to be a nice uh nice way to kind of start the narrative for this season of catching with cletus um and yeah so i've been rambling for almost 11 minutes so if you made it this far thank you for watching like and subscribe uh if you're new to the channel welcome um and uh yeah uh it uh doesn't get much better when you feel like you got a score i mean there's a long way to go with this rig long way to go but we're close we're as close as it gets to being ready to fish 
in a $2,500 boat that you, you just don't see deals like that anymore. So I feel incredibly lucky. Um, excited to take you guys along for some of this journey. But uh, yeah, uh, tight lines and good times, everybody. Cletus out. Oh, and P.S. It came with a pretty decent landing net. Nice.